Everything was perfect. Everything was just as it should be on a normal morning. I was in bed. I was reading a book. I was at peace with myself. I was thinking about the day's activities. I was thinking, hey, I'm going to record another episode. And we're going to do DLCs. Everybody loves DLCs. I love the DLCs. But then something hit me. Something hit me and changed my entire perspective. I realized I have not done Arch Dragon Peak. If you know about Arch Dragon Peak, you know what's coming. If you don't know about Arch Dragon Peak, oh boy, we're in for a ride. So, little brief of what we're doing. We're back in Irithyll Dungeon and there's a spot over here that we found earlier when we were running from the rats, if anybody remembers that, or if you haven't seen it, if you haven't remember it, if you, words, hard, difficult. If you can't remember it or haven't seen that episode, we were running from some rats and died over there. So you take the elevator down and basically you want to come here. And at, in the beginning, you can't really do anything. There's nothing to do. But once you defeat Osiris, in the room afterwards, there's a gesture. A gesture that basically is the journey. It is the way forward. So let's get rid of... Uh, let's get rid of this for now. And we want this. Path of the Dragon. So we do that. And then we wait for a bit. And then sorcery happens. I'm hoping. There we go. Perfect. Alright, here we are. A different land, a different place, much, much higher above the world. Now, I'm trying to be very careful because I'm not sure if I'm going to get ambushed. It's a long fall. Qua. Look at that. Praise the structures. Our first enemy. Followed by our second enemy. And they do they do a mighty hard amount of damage. Mighty hard, yes. But it's no match for my club. So a lot of snaky type creatures here. Very, very slithery, very windy, very hard-hitting. And, uh... Wow! Actually, hold on. Just... Some appreciation here. That's, uh... Hey. You can see where some of the inspiration for Elden Ring structures came from. It's basically the same formula. Some arches, some... Towers with arches, and... It's quite interesting. It, it is really, really cool to see that. But we move forward now. And I believe this is... Okay, that is a fireball. So this is an elevator that we come back to later. Uh, as for where to go now, who's shooting? Okay, so there's a caster and then... Okay, so you both cast. You're both just spitting at me. There's three. Okay, three, 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 three. We'll take you one by one. There's one. There's two. And now, third one. Surprise, motherfucker. Fourth. There's a fourth. <laughs> they just they just keep coming one after the other. 
but as long as I can as long as I can bait each one out singularly, then I think we'll be okay. And while you're still in that animation, you're basically a sitting duck. So haha! -ha. Get off, get off my cliff. Only one can be king in this realm of mine. Okay, bonfire, perfect. I hope I don't get invaded. Let me check if this is an invasion spot. It might be. It definitely is. Gosh darn it. I should probably get killed. Would you, would you handsome fellas be willing to kill me? I probably, I, I probably shouldn't have been dodging if, if my goal was to die, but it's instinctual. It's ingrained in my muscle memory to just dodge whenever something's trying to strike me. I do it in real life now as well. Dodging everything. Jumping off a quiet ahead. You sick bastard. Well, gee willikers, mister. What an open field. I hope nothing comes down and tries to kill me. That would be a real unfortunate turn of events. Oh my god! Bye bye. Uh, here we go. No finger butthole. <laughs> Tis a shame. Tis a crying shame. One thing I. I kind of like, but I don't like it as well. Is that you can always see Arch Dragon Peak from wherever you are because it's so high. But. Oh! I thought I, I thought he went. I thought you went. I thought you went home. Um. Oh, okay. Let's just. Let's just get through with you. Let's do this. Come on, come on, Spooky. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Ouch. All right, cool. So, yeah, like I was saying, one thing I, I like is that you can see Arch Dragon Peak. And you're so high that it makes sense that you're above the clouds. But one thing I don't like is that you can see it when you're down there, but you can't see it when you're... What the hell am I trying to say? Okay, let me restructure this. You can see Arch Dragon Peak when you are looking up at it, but you can't see it when you're looking down at it. You can't see the rest of the world when you're looking down. So I'm going to have to rephrase this again. So you can't see Irithyll when you're on Arch Dragon Peak, but you can see Arch Dragon Peak when you are at Irithyll. That's it. That's exactly what I was trying to say. That's it. The words. The words have formed. What the blazes? What the blazes? Another? There's another? No way there's another. There we go. Go back to hell. Ricard. Who the fuck is Ricard? There we go. And then... What else? There's, there's, there's a path here. We can have a look here. I hope there's no more of those roly dudes. Ah, just my luck. Just my luck. Oh wait, Havel! Havel's up here! Forgive me, stony boy. I must speak to the stony father. The stone father, he calls me. He's just standing there, menacingly! Havel? Is that you, lad? This is gonna be rough. This is not time for love. This is time for pain. <laughs> um, Havel, Havel, mate, Mr. Havel Knight, 
Mr. Mr. Fella. Are you, uh, are you doing all right? Oh. <laughs> Actually, this would be preferable. I'm surprised that didn't one-shot me. I'll be honest. He's using a dragon's tooth. That's so cool. Alright, take it very slowly. Oh, he, he, he caught me. He got, he, he got me there. Round two. Almost there. Almost there. Just a bit more. A nice little backstab, and then... Bonk, 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 bonk. There we go. Titanite slab. Perfect. Head. Perfect. How was your vacation to Arch Dragon Peak? Don't ask me how I survived. That was pure magic. That was a miracle. <laughs> pure, pure miracle. Gesture required ahead. I'd imagine so. Oh, you... Yeah, get lost. Get lost. Go away. Did he fall off? He fell off. He fell off. <laughs> you tried to make me fall, but you fell instead, fool. Nobody can handle my might. Nobody can handle my complex stratagems. Nobody understands what goes on in the recesses of my mind. Lady Luck is on my side. Right, uh, a gesture. So, this gesture. Yes? <gasps> Perfect. Oh, okay, deep breaths. We are approaching what will be the bulk of this episode. This this will be the bulk of it. Um, I'm not going to do this in the first try. I'm not going to do this in the second try. I'm not going to do this in the fourth try. I'm not going to do this in the 17th time. I'm not going to do this in the 35th time. This is going to take a while. So what I'll do is I'll cut it up, hopefully in a way that is a little bit entertaining, but not too dragged out. And I'll try and put in... I, one thing I like to do now, I think I've, I've sort of discovered, is I like to include bits of lore into each boss fight so that while you're watching the same thing kind of happening, there's a different, like, focal point. So you don't have to always be focusing on the fight and just see me get swabbed again and again and again. But there's actually some text there that you can read that might, you know, give your brain a little bit of a sidebar for a second before you just come back into seeing the same repetitive thing so this is going to be the nameless king and hopefully fingers crossed this doesn't take me all day otherwise what i'll have to do is i'll take a few breaks and if it still doesn't work out then i'll probably spend a few more days on this episode just because i'll have to do this another day that's just the nature of how he works i should have this in the bag though because i have spent the most time on this boss but here we go. Time to... Time to kill a god.
So really cool cutscene. Sort of setting the scene for what we're about to do. So let's uh let's go. The first attempt. Whew. <sighs> let's let's uh let's pray. Actually, kind of a simple phase one. Yeah, I'm actually really happy with that phase one. Damn, too late. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness, I was way too late on the first dodge. Oh man. <laughs> I was just a second late. Oh, that's rough. That, that, mmm. <laughs> Let's go again. First phase, that first phase wasn't too bad. I just, uh, yeah, it was really, really generous. He didn't do the attack where he jumps up and, like, sprays the fire down. So that was really, really generous. Uh, yeah, second phase, I just, I, I, I dodged way too late. Well, not way too late, but late enough that I just, I, I, I got caught up in his rhythm rather than my own. I Too late again.
and then repose. Okay, that's gone straight into phase two. Not bad. Damn. That's gonna, yeah, okay. Ah, I got caught up in his rhythm again. I got caught up in his rhythm and then I wanted to heal. And uh, yeah, it didn't, it didn't work out. And now. And now. Now. A bit early. And now. And drink. And lucky. Now. 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 That was cheeky. Now. 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 Oh, damn. The lightning bolt. I completely forgot the timing on that lightning bolt. It's literally the second. It's the second it hits. Oh, that's what I need. Thunderstone plate ring. Do I have that? I do have it. I would love to do a Nameless King cosplay. I can't lie, that would be so cool. He has such an epic design. Quick heal. That's the attack I was, I was looking for. So you just want to run from that one. And that's basically when you get in too close. Aye. Quick heal before we go to phase two. Okay, don't know how this is going to work out without my, my ring.
That was what I was doing. I was taking a gamble on the repost. Still too early. Holy crap, that... Holy crap, that, that took actually a lot less time than I imagined. I think that's like the fourth try. Holy crap, I still... Your boy still has it. He still has it. <laughs> oh, that's great. That, that, oh, that's such a good fight. I love that fight a lot. I really, really do. It's just such a nice rhythm once you've got it. In the beginning, it's such a pain in the ass because you're like, he's delaying everything. And the game, the game has taught you to be very instantaneous with your dodging, but he delays some of his attacks. So you're having to figure out which is instantaneous, which is dodging. Then he does lightning and you're like, holy crap, this is a very hard boss fight. But when it clicks, when you finally understand that timing, Oh my god, it is such a fun boss fight to just sit and dial into. Oh, that was amazing. That was great. I thoroughly, I, I thoroughly enjoyed that. Honestly, I kind of want to do it again. That's, that's a, a great place to stop then. Stop while I'm riding high. Stop while uh, everything's been great. So a uh, quick little episode to just run through Arch Dragon Peak. Um, a lot, a lot, yeah, I, I, just, I just don't know what to say, that, that wasn't so bad, that, that was, that was great, so, yeah, that's it, that was great, next episode, DLC, maybe great, maybe not so great, but for now, we're riding high, so thank you for joining me, thank you for your emotional support, as always, and thank you for watching, take care and bye-bye.